This sculpted narrative goes out to all the giants upon whose shoulders I stand. If I can see further, it is only because of their storied vision. Let me begin with Richard Feynman. Richard Feynman was one of the great- What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome to another episode of Spread Love FM. I am your host, Trevor. Thank you so much for joining me here today. Today, I'm here to make an announcement, a special announcement. We will not be having our normal show our normal segments um, for those of you who are keen observers you may have noticed there's a bit of a shift in the camera angle uh, like for example this my watch the donkey the buddha with his chain that wasn't in the shot in the frame before and the reason that there's been a shift is because the permanent mount of the camera right there has been taken down so i kind of have it on a temporary rig and the reason is because we have been shooting another podcast with that rig. And this podcast has become the focus of this channel. The name of the podcast is Dallas Gardens. And the purpose of that podcast is to raise funds for another platform that we have been advertising here on Spread Love FM, which is our free market at Miguel's, Meet Us at Miguel's. And we thought it was time to close the cycle of sustainability. The free market has been funded to this point by neighbors like you. But we thought now is the time to realize the dream of having small business be the source of the funding for the free shop and for the free shoppers to support the small businesses and to have that cycle of sustainability start. And it's gonna to be tough, we know it, but we feel like if there was ever a time to do it, now is the time. So, and I'll tell you about the name, Dallas Gardens, that's my mom's name. Mm -hmm. uh, this is where we're shooting from her house, the house that she imagined and created. And the only how only folks that have lived in this house are my parents and us, the family, 23 years here in Florida. And um, she had has a lovely garden that she has been cultivating over the years. And it goes back to her days when she was a ch uh, young woman in Trinidad in the West Indies and then to Brooklyn and now here in Florida, she's always had a garden. But she's not well, she's not able to care for the garden, you care for herself anymore, which is why I came down here and I am here. But in asking for a way to sustain the free market, I prayed about it. And I had that prayer answered with a vision that the thing that I need to sustain this garden is all around me. It is here. And I had a vision that the thing that I needed to sustain the free market is here. I am in it. It is this home that the garden has been neglected because my mom can't care for it, as I said. The house has kind of fallen into disrepair. And why not renovate that value, extract that value so that the neighbors can connect with the things that we grow, the idea that my mom had, the garden. And through those purchases of the plants and the flowers that we grow here, we move that money to our free market and supply neighbors with food and some of those neighbors will spend on plants or local businesses, and then they will start to fund the free market. And then it starts to expand our circle of sustainability. 
So that's the vision, and we've already started it. You should check the show notes or check the channel. You will see Dallas Gardens, and we have a we're on day three of Dallas Gardens at the time of this recording. So, you know, this format here is going to change. I want to thank you all for following and subscribing to this point. And I want you all to also subscribe to Dallas Gardens, to follow us, to spread the word, and to also support. If you are in Hernando, in Florida, support our free shop. Support our free shop, if you can, by purchasing the plants. We have the plants now on our website, spreadlovefreemarket.com. You can purchase the plants. We have poinsettias for the holidays. We have almost 100 varieties of plants that we are sourcing from local nurseries. So we're supporting local businesses as well. While we learn here how to cultivate and grow and nurture plants ourselves. So head on over to spreadlovefreemarket.com. We have really great prices. The nurseries are working with us buy something. We have a pickup point at Spring Hill SDA where we had the original food pantry. So they're working with us as well. We have deliveries. If you need a plant flower delivered. So this is a cycle of support for the local economy while at the same time supporting our neighbors. So this is the announcement for today. This is what we are going to do. And hopefully we could get your support. And if this is uh, something that you, uh, you know, doesn't quite, you're not a plant lover or a gardener, there will be other things coming in the near future. This is the first that we're going to do because it's a resource that's here that God has given to us and we won't let it go to waste. So follow us. Uh, we're going to sign off. I'm going to sign off right now. I want you to follow us, I want you to subscribe, I want you to purchase, but I also want you to spread love, to continue to spread the message of love. I want you to support local businesses, to comp continue to empower local economies. You vote with your dollar. Shoppers unite. I also want you to keep the faith, to keep the hope, to keep the love, to pray. Prayer is a powerful thing. And if you do that, once or twice a day, you would be amazed at the results. I've seen it already. I've witnessed it. My spirituality has been an integral part of the end of season one and up to now in season two. And we'll see where this goes. So who knows how often we will uh, post a new episode on Spread Love FM. This may become the announcement channel. This may become just a platform to promote other podcasts. We don't know yet. But say subscribe to the channel because the channel we have also, I should announce now, another podcast coming soon, uh, yet to be named, but it has to do with education and autism and homeschooling. So stay tuned for that as well. We'll probably come back to announce that podcast as well. So in the meantime, thank you so much for your support to this point. I really appreciate it. And spread love. Shop local. Stay spiritual. I'm Trev, your host, and I'll see you next time. This microphone and these speakers are designed to amplify my voice, but why me? I have no simple answer. All I can say is I believe anyone with something to say should be given the chance to speak.